<laughs> 50, huh? Okay. Still very young. <laughs> Relax and enjoy. The thing is, you know, you're searching for something that you're already living. You're searching for something that you're already living. You know, all you need to do is relax and enjoy, and we'll add one more word, observe. Observe the way in which your inner reality, your inner state of consciousness interacts with the outside world. It's unique. Your life's purpose is not a doing. It is a being, and that being is you. So live your beingness, study it, write about it, reflect on it, journal it. You're already doing it. If you can just relax and enjoy it, and it will begin to blossom and find many more outlets. But searching for it, seeking for it, I don't recommend anybody to be a seeker. I'm a seeker, I'm a seeker, I'm a seeker. This whole seeker mentality turns into a pathology. Even people who are living a life of quasi-enlightenment still refer to themselves as seekers. It's become a kind of a buzzword. And, you know, we're so busy seeking, we may not actually have a look at what we've already found. So pay attention to being, pay attention to what you are, pay attention to the current expressions of the way in which your deep inner truth, your deep inner reality is interacting through you with the whole world around you. And you're going to make a wonderful discovery. It's already here.